From Jet 24, here's meteorologist Craig Flint, your weather authority. So far, that's a look live tonight. Downtown Erie with a clear sky, and that should mean a lot of bright sunshine through the day on your Sunday. So, of course, today, officially the first day of spring, uh, the equinox, sun's rays directly over the equator, so equal day, equal night. That occurs, or uh, did arrive, I should say, at 537 this morning. So, welcome to spring. And you know what? It's going to feel like it. Eh, maybe not so much tomorrow morning. It's going to be kind of brisky and chilly. Temperatures are going to be in the low 30s. Uh, but we recover nicely tomorrow. As a matter of fact, I think temperatures tomorrow probably a good 10 degrees better than where they were today. And we were in the upper 40s today, so we should be in the upper 50s to near 60 tomorrow, especially uh, near the city of Erie and right along the uh, Lake Erie shoreline. But south, best chance of getting well into the 60s. Weather watchers tonight, 35 right now at Niagara Pier, 32. Penn State Barron, 37 in Waterford. 36 in uh, Greenfield, 31 in Union City, 32 in Cory, low 30s in Girard, uh, and in Edinburgh. Crawford County, mid 30s, Cambridge Springs, Meadville at 34, still 44 though, into Franklin, 30 in Crossingville. Low 30s, you make your way towards Warren County tonight, 35 in Youngsville. So check this out, satellite Doppler radar, as far as the eye can see, a clear sky, big, fat, juicy, high pressure over top of us through all levels of the atmosphere. And when you have a ridge of high pressure of that amplitude, a large amplitude high that extends 40, 50, 60,000 feet up, it doesn't move. And that's exactly what's going to happen here as we head into not only tomorrow, but into early next week. That's the pattern. So temperatures will be above normal easily into the 60s, there's going to be a few days that we come close to 70. But again, the caveat here, right near Lake Erie, a little bit cooler with that uh, lake breeze developing, especially tomorrow and into Monday. Hey, check this out. This is through the end of March, and March marches out mild, we think, as we go into the final days of March with temperatures likely uh, above normal. Jet pinpoint for the lakeshore. Like Bruce Springsteen said, it's an empty sky. Pleasant day, uh, highs 55 to 60. South of I-90, milder. Again, these are the areas that will get at or over 60 tomorrow on Sunday. Sunny skies all day long. And for the Chautauqua Allegheny region, expect a good deal of bright sunshine, highs 59 to 64. Want a little more? Sure, seven day forecast, so more sunshine on Monday. Low 60s, but again, cooler near the lake. Solidly into the 60s Tuesday, Wednesday, and Thursday as well. We could hit 70 here. A couple of spotty showers probably late Wednesday, better chance Thursday, and then a cold front comes through Friday, so it will turn colder heading into next week. And if there's one adjustment I'd make to this forecast, it's Thursday. We might be just a, a, a little bit cooler than that, so we'll see. Uh, as uh, some new information comes into the Weather Center. But either way, let's not split hairs here. 60s near 70 in March. We'll take that. For Erie.com, you can click on the Weather tab, find the latest updated forecast right there, 24 hours a day, seven days a week. All right, Craig, thank you very much. Coming up on Jet 24 Action News at 11 o'clock.